Aquarius, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. We're going to do your new love reading. Let's see who's coming towards you. But first, we're going to check out your past, present, and future. We're going to move towards your love systematically. <clears throat> Since this is a general reading, so take what resonates, tell you what doesn't resonate. For more personal, reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email. Also, do my favorite spells, and we have crystals, right? Intention charge, high vibrational. Like, share, comment, and subscribe in the end. Aquarius, sun, moon, rising, and new sign in Aquarius. This is going to be for you. <clears throat> Check out my Instagram for more stuff, feedbacks, offers, and free horoscopes monthly. Sean. All right. So, we're going to have a look at your past first. Aquarius, let's see what's going to happen in what happened in your recent past. Okay. <clears throat> Knight of Voices. There was some sort of, uh, I feel like there was a verbal fight between you guys because I'm having this throat check right now. I feel like uh, there was some verbal fight between you and the person. <clears throat> you both had a lot of misunderstandings. Nobody was able to put their point across. Okay. I feel like your person chose someone else for marriage. Okay. When you guys had commitment like, okay, we, we will get married together or we are going to take this forward. This person immediately chose someone else over you. Let's see why. <clears throat> and there was a verbal fight that caused you a lot of stress. I feel that that hurt you, but it also hurt your person. Why did they leave you for someone else? <clears throat> Okay. They wanted to shift their life around. I feel a person was thinking about, you know, future. They thought that there was a more better future with this person if they chose them. They were thinking more about their career, how that's going to evolve, or their kids, the future, or the house that they will be living in. <clears throat> Even though they had a lot of passion towards you, desire for you. But things change in such a manner that they had to choose the other person. It could be because uh, they insisted on changing the life around. This person was going through already a lot. Traumas, anxiety, stress, depression, pressure. And to release all of that, this person decided to choose the other direction. But they're still sulking. They still miss you. I feel they know that what they did was not right, but they had to take a soul, soul, uh, not soul decision. Yeah, soul, like decision alone without discussion with you. So they had to do this. And I feel this came off as very uh, like backstabbing and untrustworthy towards you. You're still hating on this person. Let's see the present energy, Aquarius. This could have been a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Cancer, Virgo, Gemini. <clears throat> you expected marriage from this person, guys. News of inspiration, the present moment. And then we have the news of, wow, materials. You have two options in love right now. Seven of Cups. What I can see over here in the present moment, you have one person that is very attracted towards you and wants to date you, but you don't know because some of uh, somewhere this person comes off as a little infertile or unsure about future. And then there is one person that's coming with a more promise, <clears throat> who's more stable. And you're still trying to get to know how they are, like what is the compatibility in all of those things. You're attracting a lot more options, Aquarius. There is uh, people coming towards you, getting attracted towards you. <clears throat> I feel like you have one person that is attracted to you, smitten by you. And then there is one more person. The person that is attracted to you is extremely good looking. They have attention of other people also. And then there is another person that is quite rich, successful. They might have their own like an empire or something if you haven't met this person yet they're coming really 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 soon <clears throat> but in the present moment you will be like deciding between these two options because you don't even know whether these options are going to take a long uh stride to marriage or it's just like a short-term meeting so you're getting to know right now you're just figuring out tell me more 
justice what you are looking for in the end of the day is who is there for true love who is there to be by your side in your tough situation in your good times and who's going to stick around for lifetime with you that is what you're looking for feel so right now you're not interested in who has more money or who has good looks you're more interested in who has more time and energy to invest in your aquarius this could be a libra that is coming towards you but you're very clear and you're not going to cry over anyone you're not going to sulk you're not going to sink you're in such a strong powerful energy that okay fine if if this is not fit for me immediately move to the next you're not going to sit and wait and cry over things you're very very strong these days karma is with you <clears throat> you know that you deserve justice you deserve success um and you have a lot of faith in your life some of you are dealing with a leo there's a relationship proposal coming in in the present or uh, someone has proposed to you for a relationship and you're like let me think i am not sure okay that is what you're doing right now you're in this deep thought of whether should i take this forward or should i take it slow you're trying to get to know these people somewhere you are testing them okay um because of course you've been hurt in the past and you don't want to you know uh <clears throat> waste your time again for some random person coming in so yes both of these options are proposing you for a relationship and you're like i need to think about it so i feel like you're going into this deep judgment thinking okay because they have straight out laid a proposal in front of you what's going to happen in the near future <clears throat> okay turn on materials wow my gosh there's an instant proposal instant marriage that's what i'm seeing three of emotions okay the death mm? okay and then we have okay ace of voices i feel like you're going to figure out in the recent uh time that one of these options are already committed or are already married or interested in your money position power <clears throat> that will make you feel a sense of sigh a relief that finally thank god i didn't fall into it okay it wasn't a trap it wasn't a web where i fell for i used my senses in a way like you used your senses and protected yourself from this uh issue that you may have faced long later okay so what i'm seeing is this person wants you wants a relationship with you but wants to keep it as a secret affair maybe they are already married or they are already with someone else and will get married to them so something will come out in the open that will make you like completely switch doors stop uh <clears throat> entertaining these options and move towards you know the next step in your life you're already very career oriented goal oriented you're doing well in your life the ace of voices you have more time for career rather than love right now I feel that is why it keeps you strong and confident and you don't care whether something is coming towards you in love or not you're just very easy with things that I feel you want more growth in your career you want to be successful you want to be that leader in the life that keeps giving orders you know and get a lot of appreciation and money so that is what you're working on right now your life is transforming you're becoming more aware and you're not trusting people like easily that is what is happening right now and you're thankful for this change in you some of you there's a scorpio that you're getting rid of <clears throat> wow see the devil so you have figured out that there's no point of obsessing over love when it doesn't even you know exist <clears throat> there is no love right now around you for some of you who've met the person very good go forward if things are very consistent that's not the reading for you but what i'm seeing over here right now is that 
you're giving up a tendency to depend or you know that you're not wanting to obsess over things so right now you know you can sense the energies and vibes of a person if this person's gone in the end of the day make you linger over them or go along with you with flow so you are very aware of this thing <clears throat> you come off as detached these days you also come off as leave me alone and don't mess with me kind of a person and some people are scared of you even at your workplace they cannot mess with you because of the vibes that you're giving you're very much in your own and you don't care about others you know uh coming in the way of others in a way like if your path is such that that a lot of people will get defeated so be it that's what you're being like a badass b-i-t-c-h that is good <clears throat> Some of you, there's a Capricorn that you need to be really, really careful from in your work, maybe, or in your love life. In the near future, please tell me more about the devil and the ace of voices. Okay. Page of inspiration. You do have some options that are lusting over you coming towards you. So you're taking more time to, you know, relax and not jump into things, as I was telling you and you're doing one task at a time you're definitely loaded with a lot of work so you want to put one foot at one time you don't want to multitask otherwise you'll get into that emotional mess you don't want that so right now you're taking one step at a time you're growing you're getting the output you're happy now move to the next so it is building a momentum inside of you to become more uh, passionate and thriving towards your dreams and goals Someone is taking too long to make an offer and you know that this is not good. So you are pushing that, that person away. Ten of Voices. You're not interested in these options coming towards you right now. You're very happy being in your own energy. You're very happy wherever you are. You're thankful that the universe has given you this opportunity to just live for yourself, enjoy your life, be in the present moment and have fun. That is what is going on with you. Okay, so you're having fun. You're just giving yourself an ample ample time space love okay so you're well rested these days not bothered about how others are thinking not seeking validation or stuff like that let's see what's new in love coming in towards you wow five of wands all of these options that have felt rejected or ignored by you have been talking behind your back and they think that you're a snob or your egoistic or your arrogant but the truth is not that it's just because they couldn't win you so that is why they're talking behind your back they couldn't win over you you defeated them without hurting them that is what is making them feel so antsy and jealous and irritated and you know talking behind your back and gossiping that's all <clears throat> what i'm seeing is a someone that is crushing over you this could be a scorpio pisces cancer and dreaming about having kids with you or kind of like having a deep commitment where you guys are lost in your own world. But they think that you're not interested. You're too busy in your life. You're not interested. And you see this person as just another joker. Okay. So I feel like you can expect a message from this person coming in. A love message from this person coming in telling you that, hey... I like you and you might also see it as a hint like a hint message containing hints that they like you they are taking a lot of time because they're freaking out I'm also seeing your person as someone if it's a male you're asking me about a masculine they may have more feminine uh, approach or features okay they can see you being in self-love they can see you not giving importance to you know too much of uh you know desperation or clinginess is not there not giving importance to people coming in that is attracting them they they feeling like you're a person of love and you respect yourself a lot so they can trust on you and they're seeking your love so bad that you won't realize like yeah is it like you might even push this person away for some few times because this person keeps coming back to you because there is <clears throat> self-respect you have for yourself so i'm seeing this person has a crush and they're seeking your love the, yeah they are going to actually ask you out real soon they will be like okay i'm interested let us take it you know a notch up let's uh have you know 
let's spend time together to get to know each other so this person has a lot of expectations here you will not uh, dismay them you will definitely understand that this person is coming from a genuine source so you will give them a chance but this person is freaking out that's what i'm seeing they're falling in love four of swords you will give them a little hard time a little bit but you will be hard to get a little bit but i feel like they're liking this but you're calm. It's not like you're worried or you're anxious. You're also loving the attention from this good person coming towards you. You feel like maybe this is the one. Somewhere deep down you're thinking and you're taking this seriously and you'll feel maybe this is the one. So it might take some few, uh, you know, fishes in the sea before you meet the one. Okay. This person might take some time to come into your life, but it's happening. Like probably in one or two months or even nine months. I don't know. But I'm definitely seeing this is what is about to happen in the near future. Okay. Wow. Your life is turning around pretty fast. I feel this will be a quick decision from you that, okay, leave everything aside. I trust this person. I'm going to say yes. So I feel in the end of the day, you're trusting them and saying yes. And this is like a game changer for you. This is like a dream come true for you. So there's a new beginning where you will be going to the next phase in your life taking this person with you so you see them as being right and you guys may be working together or can expect you guys to work together so maybe you guys will be like into real estate or something that involves a lot of traveling even if you're working together you guys may take up similar projects or you guys may get into some sort of a business partnership. But I'm definitely seeing if you guys work together, there's going to be a lot of expansion. So I'm seeing in three months from now, there's a possibility you guys will meet. The judgment. So there's a possibility also that instant uh, love uh, leading to instant marriage take place. So you will take your time. This person is very intelligent. They might be into academics or something. They're very like... Maybe a nerd, but I'm definitely seeing this person could be into a corporate job, law, or someone like authoritative and, you know, a powerful personality I'm seeing. Some of you, this could be into police. This could be a Libra. You're definitely very lucky to be in this person's life. Uh, to, that this person is in your life. You will feel extremely privileged because people are going to be like looking up to you and they're like, oh my gosh, this person is there wife or their husband or their partner and they're they're so good you guys will have a child with this person or they just treat you like a little kid or this person acts like a kid when they're in front of you one person is acting more like uh, a mature person like a father or a mother figure message this is someone that you might meet while traveling or this is someone that may come towards you in a form of a professional bonding initially a message might come from overseas or from a different place that this person is coming to meet you regarding some professional um you know meeting or connection and that's how you guys will uh, you know grow from there you will realize that this person is trying to talk to you and get more closer initially you might find this cheesy so this person is someone that loves your optimism and what else make the effort they are the one that's making the effort here yes they will be asking for this love from you they'll be rather begging for it nice and then they will be expressive i feel they want you to just feel it and not try to control this because they might see you as someone that is controlling a little more and not opening up much they want you to believe in them have faith and positivity They'll be making efforts and expressing their feelings. They just want you to be more uh, receiving and embracing and acknowledging this person's efforts towards you. You will give them a chance and probably get married to them as well. You guys may work together. Somewhere I feel like there might be a situation where you guys are so much together. Everywhere you're going, you guys are together. That might create some sort of a need of having space. So maybe that is something that you may need to adjust with this person about 
or give each other more space maybe this person is not able to give you more space or you're not able to give them more space so there's a need of discussion here um yeah so that's pretty much it i hope you've enjoyed this reading aquarius do not forget to like share comment and subscribe if you like this new style of reading do mention the comment section like share subscribe so that more and more people can come in and i'll see you back with more stuff bye